How's it going, guys? Dre here, and welcome to Riot Civil Unrest. Now, this is one I am very excited about. It's been in development for a long time now, and finally, it's going to be released on the end of December. I believe the 29th or the 30th is when the game officially releases. We're checking out the closed beta today, and I gotta say, it's going to be good. So, in this game, you either control an angry mob of riders, or you control the police that tries to subdue them. Uh, there's different missions that you can do, all based on real-world riots, which is really cool to me. Uh, so we're gonna check out some of them today, have some fun, and, uh, yeah, hopefully do this successfully. Alright, well, let's waste no time, get right into the story mode, and do one or two of these missions. So, here are some of the different riots going on throughout the world. Uh, again, these are based loosely on real-world riots, so, uh, where do we want to go today? Now, I have done a little bit of this Italy one, so I think we're gonna go there, start it over, and you guys can witness it as well. Locals fight with all they have got against the corruption that lies beneath the construction of a 23 billion euro high-speed train project. So we're gonna keep it on easy right now. It goes from easy to challenging, so I'm gonna say, you know what, I don't really know what I'm doing yet, so let's try with the easy. And now we get to choose. We can either be the rioters or the police. Uh, I definitely want to be the rioters. That sounds like more of a fun job. It would probably be more difficult to be a policeman, but uh, yeah, rioting sounds fun. So, public opinion minus two, displacement too easy. So, uh, that's kind of what explaining what you're doing. Now, I actually did do the first one already, which unlocks the next thing you need to do, which unlocks the third and unlocks the fourth. And then I'm assuming you beat the, uh, the riot. So we're gonna start right from the top here and get back into this. So we're going to Italy to uh, riot against a train being built. The Italian government started building a massive transportation system in the Sussa Valley TAV high-speed train to speed up the already existent transportation from Sussa to Lyon. The project is expected to be concluded by in 2035, and I couldn't read the rest of that, so uh, it is still ongoing, obviously. All right, and this art style is just amazing. Documents predict that before concluding the construction process, most of the forest... Why is it going so quick? I want to read it. Uh, all right, well, I guess I missed that one, too. Activists have been protesting and fighting against the TAB project since 1992. Wow, that is a long time time. Almost as old as me, and now I feel definitely old. Okay, so now we get to choose. We can choose items here. Ooh, okay, so I didn't even do this before, so there is a lot of strategies to this. We need to basically equip our rioters. I don't really know what the flags do, but it's suggested to keep it on some, so we're gonna keep that defensive gear. Uh, you can go, you can see, you can go all the way up to, like, Guerrilla Warfare, and then you can go all the way down to Defenseless. Uh, expected participation, dep depending on what gear you have, uh, obviously drops. The more crazy the gear, the less people that will probably show out. Or show up, rather. So I'm gonna do... I think we need lots of people, so I wanna do basic. Defenseless seems dumb. So let's keep basic just in case something bad happens. And we currently have, uh, calls for additional help via social networks. Okay, so I do like that. And then this one, Malox, temporarily reduces smoke grenade effects. Okay, so what else do we want? Uh, very small explosive which causes a loud detonation on impact used to agitate opponents. And then we got firecrackers if you want to do more than just one to really piss them off. I kind of want to get Molotovs. Do I want to go that crazy though? Regroups rebels boosting attention and discipline. All right, let's do that. I want to keep the megaphone. We, the, the whole goal here is to keep the riot intact. Extra rocks and backpack. Um... Everything else, I guess we could get firecrackers. I, you know what, just in case, let's have some sort of weapon, just in case crazy stuff happens, because all we really have is ourselves. So having Molotovs will be smart. All right, so we're going to ready up here and uh, get right into it. All right, the rising sun is here. June 27th, 2011. Police are coming, and I love this game. I just want to say that right now. Everything about this game, this is my favorite art style, this kind of realistic pixel vibe, absolutely love it. Alright, so it looks like we're, oh, we're calling in the troops, that's what we're doing. Everybody wake up, we got stuff to do. And here comes the police, with a bulldozer. Okay, wow, oh, ooh, what did they just shoot? That, that must have been uh, tear gas there, they're pushing whatever we made back, and uh, yeah, they're using brute force, it looks like. Alright, looks like we're not too happy, and... 
Uh, what is this view right now? I mean, that's some nice grass. It's a nice chair there. There we go. There's the riot that I'm talking about. So protect all tenants. Uh, I, I'm assuming we just need to protect. Police must destroy objective in four minutes. Okay, so let's move up some of these riots here. You can see we have groups of riots or rebel teams. We can move these guys up. We, we want to keep the police as far back as possible. So I'm just going to kind of move these up just a little bit. I don't want to get, you know, too aggressive or anything, but we have all the stuff that we have uh, at our disposal up here. We can hold position. Let's do that real quick. And I just want to make sure it's very hard to tell what's going on. In typical Riot fashion, it's never the easiest to see. So this guy's over here. Let's bring these guys up. And let's make sure we stop these police from moving in. So what do we, should we, yeah, let's call social. Let's get some more people in here. Hey, we saw your cause online. We're here to help, and here they come in from the woods. That is so cool. So can we? Can each unit do that? I think they can. All right, that's cool. So, yeah, let's increase our numbers right now. We just called in all the social media, and the numbers are being increased. How are we doing in the front here? It's very hard to tell what's going on. Uh, you can see our HP bars, though. No one's being really attacked just yet. Uh, so I think we're okay. So right now, I don't really think uh, we really need to do too much here. Uh, we just need to hold the police back. It seems like we're doing that. Most of them are on the front lines right now. And we just need to, well, the police need to destroy the objective. So what we're doing right now is just building a wall in typical riot fashion. All right, looks like our social media is ready to go again. Let's boost that in. Let's get some more social media done and get some more people in here to overwhelm these police. I would hate being the police right now because look at the look at the amount of mob that we have already. I'm only seeing like maybe 30 policemen there. It looks like right then the hard way it is. The stimulants are kicking in. Oh god. Okay. It looks like we're gonna start fighting here. Uh, that means okay. Two minutes left. Yeah, they are getting aggressive. People are running away. No, you guys must stay. We need to. Okay, hold on. You 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 use use the megaphone. Use the megaphone on these guys. And let's try and keep as many here as possible. Again, it's very hard to tell what's going on, uh, but we're yelling at the people to tell them to stay, I think. And it seems to be somewhat working. We got lots of people here, man. Uh, stand down, let's try and avoid this conflict. Should we actually go into offensive mode and start attacking? Yeah, you know what, let's do it. Offensive mode, we got two minutes left, and we need to start fighting back. Let's do it, fight back, hit these guys, and you can see the, the team that's offensive is right here. Uh, kind of in the middle, where we're all kind of stuck in on each other. Let's actually turn everyone into offensive. Let's go crazy. Let's kill some cops. Uh, that's probably not going to help with my uh, ad revenue right now. But, uh, yeah, let's get aggressive here, and let's start pushing these guys in. All right, so we are going to... Oh, yeah, people are running away like crazy. Some people don't want to be offensive. So, right then, the hard way it is... Okay, let's actually... Should we Molotov? I just want a Molotov just to try it. There we go. Throw it in! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. I love this game. I don't know if I'm doing it right, but you know what? Yeah, let, let, let's back down a little bit. We threw a Molotov. We showed them who's boss. Oh, I just put it back into offensive mode. Okay. All right. Our, our presence is dwindling, so let's call in social media to fight this once again and uh, help us out a little bit. Oh, man, we're throwing stuff at them. This is, there's so much on the screen. You can see why this game is so cool. Yeah, we're throwing rocks at them and stuff. Yeah, we are not happy right now. Let's, uh, can we actually move up a little bit? Yeah, let's move up, boys. Let's do this. Get, get the big pack moving up. The problem is the cops are pushing us back, so we're kind of stuck at this standstill, which is what we want to do. We just want to hold them off. I got a little aggressive there and started fighting them. I don't think we needed to do that, but that, that that's the fun part, you know? I didn't throw any rocks, at least. All right, area was successfully protected. Yes, the riot wins again. All right, let's see how we did here. We had 374 members, and my assumption was correct. They had about 30, 32. Uh, rebels, only 14 were wounded. We did, <laughs> ah, yeah. To typical rebel fashion, we did a lots in property damage. We didn't kill any policemen or wound any, though, so there really wasn't that many people affected just 14 wounded which is pretty impressive for a riot military result we had 83 i'm assuming that means we were very militaristic uh and then political result we were minus six they were minus 53 though so i don't really know why uh all right so now this will lead to an extreme advantage of the rioters side during the next event yes okay that's good let's go to the newspaper 
Police unable to evict protesters. Yeah, you don't say. We threw Molotovs and stuff. This afternoon at 1532, 30 policemen were unable to evict the 300 protesters from the occupied area. After 14 injuries in 15 minutes, people questioned whether or not the kind of violence that came out was necessary. Admittedly, maybe I jumped the gun there. My bad. R riots should be peaceful. I have to remember that. Okay, so what do we want now? What do we have now? F okay, so it is telling me to bring firecrackers. So, I'm assuming the suggesteds are things that we are definitely gonna need. So, let's just bring one more thing here. I'm, I kinda like the Molotovs, I gotta be honest here. Megaphone might be smart, though, to keep people at, at uh, you know, working with us. So, we don't really have too many weapons, but I think that's gonna be good. Now, I still don't know what these flags are. I'm assuming that is how many groups we have. So, I'm just gonna keep it at some. Defensive gear, cautious. Uh, yeah, let's keep it with that. That worked well last time. All right, we're December 8th. Objective, lead crowd. Okay, well, that's simple enough. I, th by the way, this is as far as I've gotten in the game, so everything else is new to me. In a revolution as a novel, the most difficult part to invent is the end. All right, let's start this up and knock, knock. Knock, knock, multiple people. Oh, uh, we are riding. Yes. All right, looks like this truck's trying to get out, and we don't want to let it out. Yes, that's exactly what's happening here. And we're walking through the forest. Where could we be going? This is, I love the little cutscenes they got. Is that a naked Jesus? What was that? He wasn't even moving. Is he even part of the riot? All right, whoa, Jesus, they already shot stuff on me. Get inside the construction camp. Okay, so we have to use brute force to move in. All right, boys, I really wish, is there a way to tell all teams? Why are you guys running away already? No, get back, get back. We are gonna use brute force to get in here. Let's push these guys to the side. Uh, and then we have both lines, or sorry, both entrances affected. So is there any other actually way to get in? I can't seem to zoom out to look over here. So this is pretty much all we have. All right, let's just tell them to continue to move all the way in if they can. We're gonna push up those lines Push the police as hard as we can, and hopefully break their lines here peacefully. Rebels must reach the target in 215. Okay, let's, uh, firecrackers. Let's throw some firecrackers. Screw them up a little bit. Yeah, that's actually going to help a lot. And, yeah, now we're pushing in. There we go. Throw some more firecrackers at the police. Firecrackers are great. Maybe we should use our megaphone as well just to tell these people to push in, and let's do this. Yeah, there we go. All right, me megaphone it up once again, and oh, okay, so I understand. You actually use the megaphone and tell them where to go. Protest reached destination, though, so that wasn't too bad. Just threw a few firecrackers, yelled on the loudspeaker a little bit, and nobody even got hurt. Look at that, that's the perfect riot. You get what you need done without nobody getting hurt. Just a little bit of property damage there. What do we gotta do this time? Objective Occupy. We have five minutes to do it, and it's a highway. That's all we really know, so it doesn't really give you too much information, which I actually really like. I mean, it's a typical Riot fashion, you're not gonna have much information. I don't know if we wanna get armored, though. Whoa, protected is 549 people? How much is, like, basic? 700 people, and then 800 for defenseless. Uh, I'm, I think I'm still gonna stick with Cautious. It was telling me to do Protected, though. But, how many people is that? That's only 50 people, yeah, let's let, let's keep with the suggested. And, everything in here was already in here except for the camera. Do we have social callout? I don't think we do. We have Molotov. Okay, so it is gonna get crazy if we already have Molotovs on. We also have the rocks. So, this is where the fighting's gonna happen, and firecrackers. So, I really need something that can bring new units in. So, I'm either thinking the megaphone, which really helps to push the units and make them listen, or social, which will get additional help. You know what? Let's do the megaphone. It worked out last time. I think we have the units that we need to really do this well without bringing in any more. So, we're gonna ready up, and, uh, yeah, now we're getting to the fun stuff. Alright, here we are. We are affecting the highway. It looks like it is nighttime, as you can see. Everybody's just chilling right now. Is this guy dan- oh, there was a guy dancing over there. What are they doing? I, I love the art style because you don't really know what exactly everything is, but, uh... Whoa, that is- it's so beautiful. Like, just this simple pixel art's amazing. 
All right, here we go. The chopper's coming in. And here we are. Oh, God. Look at the police force with Bulldozer right in the front. Oh, they're gonna break down our barricade right away. Man, this is real. This is why I, that's why I love this game because of how real it is. Like, these are real-world events that really happened. Uh, that is just absolutely crazy to me. Is he... Uh-oh. Oh, no. All right. We, we, we got her back, but I, I don't know what really happened there. Well, we don't look too happy. There's all the flags. We are riding now, officially. <laughs> look at this. This is so cool. All right, here we are. Uh, complete the objective within the time limit. Occupy the A32 highway. Well, we're occupying it. Let's uh, move in right away. Rebel oh, we only got two rebel teams. Rebel team three is in the back here. Let's, uh, okay, let's keep those back there because we got these guys over here. And let's start pushing in. So megaphone it up, push them in. And you know what? I think we're gonna have to get right into the craziness already because uh, it's gonna get crazy. So let's go into offensive mode. And let's start fighting. Let's get crazy and see what we can do. Maybe this is too aggressive too quick, but aggression's my middle name, so let's do this. Oh, oh, they, they threw something at me. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna megaphone and hopefully bring these guys a little bit further down. I'm trying to push them up, but uh, it's not working. Let's actually firecracker, ooh, a little bit of lag there. Firecracker this right here because they got a lot of units going on. And there we go. That's going to help out a lot. And let's actually do that multiple times with all of our members. Look at all these police here. Keep throwing the firecrackers in. Keep confusing them. And keep the pressure on. All right. Maybe I got aggressive too early. We are dwindling our numbers. People are pulling back, as you can see. I'm trying to megaphone them as much as I can. But it's not working very well. Okay. We got to actually... Let's use the Malox because that's going to affect the smoke screen. And <laughs> look at this. This is this is such a surreal experience. There's no game like this, and that's what's so cool about it. All right, keep firecrackering them. That's all we can really do here is firecracker and uh, and just keep fighting them. So we just got to keep using these firecrackers, keep using the malox on my guys, make them happy. I guess we could throw some rocks as well. Let's actually do that. There we go. Peg a few heads off with some rocks. That's always fun, right? Don't forget the firecracker either. They are pushing us back, so this is a little scary. I'm trying to megaphone to get everybody to come closer. Come on. We need to stay on the bridge. There's only two minutes more. All right. Looks like we got some cops back here as well. Oh, what is that? There's, there's a guy with a gun? Oh, God. That's not good. Okay. We, we, we are breaking it up, though, as you can see. Uh, I don't know what that means. I guess that's shield guys. So, yeah, we, we're still learning the game a little bit here, but this is just... Look at... Oh, God. Oh, what did they just bring in? Oh, this is bad for us. This is real bad. All right, fire, firecracker. That's all we can do. Oh, we're just being pushed back like crazy. Oh, no. They did it. They did it. They're just killing us left, right, and center. Come on, megaphone. We need to push in there. Everybody, everybody, we need to come in. We, we need to bring this back. Yeah, the, 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 the megaphone is all I can really do right now. It's working. We're pushing up a little bit. My God, look how spread out we are, though. We did truly push back a lot. All right, we have came back. Careful, men. The press will eat us alive if we're too furious. You know what? I don't care about the press, the press right now. We are pushing up. Yes, they're pushing back. Okay, they have more shields coming in, though. We have to be careful about that. Let's actually see if we can firecracker them on the way in. Throwing it, and... Bam! There they go. Yeah, really confused them up, actually. 29 seconds left. I need to throw lots of firecrackers to scare them because they're pushing us up again. All right, megaphone. We need, we need to stay. Push in, guys. Push in. Everybody that has a megaphone, use it. And it's working. We got 13 seconds left. Oh, this was a rough one. We're kind of holding it. I can't. Oh, God. We're being pushed out, though. We're being pushed out hard. All right. Firecracker, firecracker. Come on. Just keep holding it a little bit. Did we do it? Yes! Area successfully occupied. Man, that was not easy though. I was constantly being pushed out of it. All right, I'm curious to see how many people I lost. Uh, Rebels wounded 65. We only wounded one policeman. So yeah, we really should have brought those Molotovs, I think. 140 policemen were unable to evict the 900 protesters from the occupied area. The clashes ended up with one injured police and more than 65 injured activists. The fight lasted 16 minutes. So, uh, yeah, we didn't get very good press, but we did it. 
The beginning of an end. So I think this is the final mission in this one. So let's do that. And uh, we have four minutes to do it. Property damage. Oh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. We got bombs. What is that? Oh, it is a paper bomb. DIY grenade made out of gunpowder, cardboard, plaster, and other materials. That's hardcore. All right. So it has a suggested loadout right now. I'm actually happy with this loadout. We got rocks. What is this? Rockets. Okay. Fireworks uses rockets. Pretty common riot material. And firecrackers, of course, which did help a lot. I actually like the megaphone as well, though. So I think I might change the rocks for a mega... No, you know what? It's suggesting it, so I'm going to keep with the suggested. And defensive gear. Yeah, let's stick with armored here. Only 98 people, though. How much do we get if we go to protected? Okay, not really that much. It's not worth it. 2015 now. It's been a few years. I think we're pretty mad now. All right, looks like destroy all generators within the time limit. Simple enough. Paper bomb it up, buttercup. Let's do this thing. And, uh, yeah, let's start affecting these. So we're just gonna, just gonna come in here. And, yeah, let's just move everybody in, actually. So, because the cops are gonna start moving in as well. Yeah, this could get really bad. I like that there's not many units as well. So this could get fun really, really quickly. All right, so I'm going to paper bomb this. Can't be used by peaceful groups. Okay, so that's the issue. We need to actually go to offensive mode to start doing this. So let's do that and paper bomb it. There we go. Bam, blow it up. Oh, oh my God, I just killed someone. Oh, that, that was gruesome. That was real gruesome. All right, we're, we're actually beating it up as you can see and I think it's totally broken, but just to make sure, yes, now it's broken. I killed someone else by the way. Uh, I'm really good at, you know, killing my own units, I guess. All right, let's blow up this one now. So do we only have two that we have to blow up? Oh, my God. This is so cool. Is that someone on fire? I can't tell. It's, it's hard to see with the pixels, but uh, I think someone's on fire here. Okay, let's move in. Keep moving in. Keep moving in. Yeah, that's right. Back up. All right, let's see if we can get a good throw in. Oh, my God. That was a good one, actually. Oh, we got police vans coming out. You know what? Throw bombs into that, too. This is this is all about the bombs. Let's actually, yeah, let's affect the units here. Oh, this is going to be bad. Watch this. There's a bomb in there. There it goes. We didn't actually kill anyone, though. All right. Well, that was actually not as bad as I thought. Okay. We are spreading out way too much. I don't have any way to get them back in. Let's firecracker it up. And we got another bomb coming in. That one went perfectly into it. Let's see if we can do it. We only got a minute left. I'm still throwing bombs like crazy, but they keep hitting my units which is affecting me. Okay, come on, it's so close. All right, this one's down. I think a lot of my units have run away, which isn't good. I should probably use my rockets. That's something that, uh, fireworks, there we go. Let's use that. It's not going well. People are seriously losing it. They're damaging a squad car. I've almost completely destroyed a squad car. Yes, that's good. But uh, yeah, my units aren't doing so well. We only got nine seconds left. I don't think we're gonna be able to get in there. I should have used the rockets much earlier. I thought I had more time, and no. Crowd failed to destroy the objectives. We got one of them. I guess the good thing is we had zero rebels wounded, whereas they had one policeman wounded. So uh, political result is rather low. So let's retry that again and see if we can do a bit better this time. All right, we're doing a lot better this time. I have figured out kind of how to control them a little bit better. Bombs are definitely useful for destroying things though. Surprise, surprise. We only got one minute to do this though, so hopefully we can actually do it. These things take forever to take down. All right, we are beating it up though, so that's good. And I'm throwing bombs on top of my members, so that's probably not the smartest idea. All right, that one's crumbled. Everybody, get back, get back, get back. Come on, we just need to get this final one, and then we're done. All right, mo mo most of my rebels have fallen back. They are a little bit scared. There we go though, all objectives successfully destroyed. We did it. That was not easy to actually target things with rebels. But as you can see, we did it. We wounded one once more again. Uh, did a lot of property damage. And uh, yeah, that was just awesome. Let's see what the newspaper has to say today. Only property, not humans. Protesters avoid physical harm after vandalizing. Go us! Yes, we even got good publicity. Despite the resistance of 20 police officers, several acts of property damage were caused by rioters in Italy. Some mild clashes occurred, but nobody was severely injured during the event. All right, can't get much better than that. We've unlocked new modes. 
Uh, okay. Notre Dame de Slandes. And we also unlocked the paper bomb, which we saw a lot of at this final one. So yeah, that was really fun. Oh, we got rockets as well. Wow, we unlocked a lot of stuff. DIY smoke as well. Colored eggs. Temporary makes a target who gets hit unusable by the opponent. Okay, interesting. And we've unlocked 0.44. They used to call this Boxer 44 because of the power of his fist. So yeah, we must get like random rioters in our group that I haven't even noticed. Uh, we've also unlocked journalist mode, global mode. Okay, so we unlocked a lot doing our first major mission. And we got another cutscene here. The rioters seem to be leaving. Uh, is order back in order? What is that? Uh-oh. He's got a gun out. Wait, what? What's he? Okay, this guy's naked. No tab. Okay, so we completed it. We won. The police got pushed back. All right, well, that was Riot No Tab. We even get, like, an ending cutscene whenever we do any of these. That is so cool. So... Yeah, let me know if you guys like this or not. Once again, this was Riot Civil Unrest. Now, this is going to be coming out at the end of December. If you want to know anything more about it, links will be in the description of this video. And yeah, let me know if you guys want to see some more different riots. Obviously, this game has been in development for years now, and you can tell by the amount of detail that was just in that, that one mission. So thank you guys so much for watching and liking. I'll see you in the next one.